Hello everyone, this is David from goldstartool.com and uh, today I'm going to go ahead and show you different type of feet that we have available for Juki 11, 81, a walking foot machine uh, or a GS-0303 um, as you know one of the best selling walking feet machine in the market is the Juki 1181 and um, we sell a lot of this machine to uh, the public and we get a lot of calls. Now Juki 1181 is the same as new tech uh, GC-0303. GC-0303 is made by, Go by new tech and we are the distributor for it. So whatever I'm saying right now about this everything that you hear in this video that has to do with Juki 1181 is the same thing applies for new tech GC-0303. Right, Jasmine? So yes. Jasmine is going to learn. So when you guys call in and you have questions, she could tell you what's <laughs> going on. Now, um, Juki 1181, when we talk about walking feed machine, it has its own feet. Uh, every factory, console, Juki, Brother, Mitsubishi, uh, New Tech, they have their own type of feet. The way they think these uh, snap on to your um uh, food bar but when we talk about walking food machine here the feet we're talking about the set a lot of companies out there sell this feet um in separate meaning single we don't we sell them together as a set so whatever you see here we sell as a set and when you go online, it's already priced as a set. All right, so we're gonna go over the feet and we're gonna go over the uh, plate, bobbin, bobbin case, feet dog, and I'm gonna show you the new way to go with the um, making your feet a Teflon feet. There are not many, many, many Teflon feet out there for the walking food machine. At least I haven't seen them. I'm working on getting some. Um, but there is a way that you could make this to a walking feet. Because a lot of, of you complain that when you use the feet on leather, uh, it makes a mark, the teeth mark. But we're going to try to see if we could solve that. Okay, so first thing first. These are the plate. And there is only one type of plate for uh, Juki 1181. It said in the back B20, all right? But this also works with GS0303 and some console uh, machine out there for walking feet. This is the plate. There's only one kind. We don't have a Teflon feet on that one, but there is the number for this one when it comes to Juki. Um, uh, part number is 400-21615. That's the one. One size of needle, one size of needle hole and only one type and this is the feed dog that goes with it and we sell that one also online and that one if i could see uh the part number is 12481 and uh you'll see it online we have them uh, we gotta buy them separately so this is um i just heard that some companies out there make the teflon uh, which is the green color. I'm trying to get those, but for right now, I have only these two types uh, in our website for the 1181. Bobbin, they're M bobbins. The bobbin for the, the big capacity M bobbins, you could choose the color. You could choose black or silver, it doesn't matter. And this is the Teflon one, I mean the aluminum. Some people like the aluminum, they're both the same. You might find them after under different number, but if you search M bobbin, you'll find these bobbins. And they're pretty cheap on our website. So these are the one for 1181. And also the bobbin case. Uh, the bobbin case is also on our website and it's 18045. Uh, 18045. Now, for the this is good for Juki 1181. As I said, new tech GS0303, and any sewing machine that uses M bobbin, you could use this. Now, 
when you people call in and talking about the spring inside, this is the no lash back, the spring inside. When you put your bobbin inside, you see how it plays? In it, it, it makes sure that the thread doesn't rewind. And see, when you want to try, see, um, the bobbin, empty bobbin is in there, but I have the latch up, and as I release, it comes down. So this is the spring that we're talking about. We have them at a very reasonable, reasonable price on our website, and it's class M bobbin, 18045, and it also works with console. Besides Juki, works with console and new tech. All right. These are very important stuff that I wanted you to see. Plate, feed dog, bobbin, and bobbin case. Now, we'll come to the most, most, most important part of this uh, video that I'm taking. Um, I think we have the most collection of sewing machine feet for any walking food machine. And this is only for Juki 1181. We also have them for console and different style. But this is, again, this is for Juki 1181. First off, first, the standard, you see the number here, U192, U193. Okay, it means that outside is U192, inside is U193. Now, we sell everything as a set. You might have the U192 and not the U193 in your set. Your set might be different, and I'll show you what I mean. So, this is the set, it's a normal one that comes with the machine. It has a teeth. The, all the sets that we sell here is $9.99. It makes each one of these about $4.98. It's $9.99 for a set. And uh, U192-193 is a standard type of set that it has uh, teeth underneath. So a lot of people complain that, hey, this makes a mark on our leather. Now, we have the no teeth underneath, if you take a look. There are no teeth, same type of um, feet, bigger hole, but no teeth. So this one will not make a mark on your, it's plain, or uh, no teeth on the bottom, same thing. U192, 193 with no teeth, all right? So this is something that you might want to use if you don't want to use, I'm going to show you the Teflon later on, okay? Zipper foot, very, for any type of right sewing, zipper foot, uh, or uh, right toe. I have don't have the left toe, I'm getting to the left toe, but right now only we have the right toe. This is the outside, this is the inside, all right? U192T, U192T. Now, U192 plus U193S, this is your right hand in judgment. S, is yes. that an S? Yes. That's a very tiny S. <laughs> okay, so this is the open toe. Look. You see the toe? It's open. Mm -hmm. So the outside is U192, like this one that I just showed you guys. But inside is different. U193S. Outside U192, inside U193, that's the same exact thing with the bottom tooth and the open toe. Everything is in our, on our website, all right? Now, um, this is the left toe zipper foot, U1, uh, 6013 plus U193, U193 inside and uh, 601-3 outside. Now, you might say these two are the same, they're not the same. The zipper foot and this is much smaller, tinier, and this is much bigger. Uh, this is a huge foot. This one you could use for cording for very hard places to sew. That's U192, U183. U601-3, U193, this one, you could, um, uh, for heavier type of zipper, like number 10, size 10, huge army zippers, or for tent, you could use this one. But if you have very tiny stuff, this is it. This is the one. Now, 
We also have compensating binder foot, uh, 601-3 outside, and inside is 521BW. This is if you have a binder, meaning you have a binder to the right-hand side. Now, these are, I can't hold them, but this will go to the left-hand side of a binder, meaning this is your foot, and this is your inside, uh, and then you have your binder here, all right? You want uh, 601-3 plus 521BW, uh, compensating binder foot, okay. Uh, edge guide, we have three type of edge guide, 601-3 plus U193SG, this is a 330 second, Next to it is quarter and 316. Uh, and that's how they are. Edge guide for very tiny edge. You see on the bottom? If you're doing the edges. So this is 330 seconds from the edge. This is quarter inch from the edge. Okay. And this is 316 from the edge. Meaning it will hold... The, if you're doing from the edge right here, mm -hmm. the stitch would be 3 16 when it's going down. So outside is the same. When it comes to 601-3, inside are different. 3 16 very popular item, by the way. 3 16 quarter and 3 10 seconds. Uh, next one. Oh, I'm sorry. The, we also had the 1 8 on this one. 601, we have a milestone in 1 8. Tiny, tiny, tiny. So, 1 8, 3 16, quarter, 3 30 second. That's four of them. Uh, if you have any complaint regarding the video, uh, call in and talk to Jasmine because she's the one that's moving around, not me. <laughs> uh, U193K, U192K, welting and piping feet, quarter inch. It's a piping feet right in the middle. And you see this? Mm -hmm. That. For it's a quarter inch for piping. If you do piping inside also, see, we got that tunnel type of thing. So this is quarter inch and this is 3 16th. See how they match? Okay, inside and outside. So U193K and U192K. These are the ones. Uh, thread. As I always say, I have many, many types of the nylon T70 or T60, both of them are on our website. Uh, or um, T70 polyester. Now, um, we have two or three different thickness of Teflon tapes. And I show, and I've done this before on a different type of Another video. Um, this is, I have light, medium, and I have another one that is very heavy, but I'm gonna try this too. Any type of surface that you have that you wanna make yourself, you could totally glue this thing on. And it's not a big deal at all. You could do it, and it's very easy. Um, what you do is just get a, um, Super glue. what do you call this? Crazy glue. Crazy glue. And you go around it, and then go ahead and put this on, and let it sit for what, five, 10 minutes? When you're done, just go get a laser braid and cut around it, okay? And then you'll be perfect. It makes now, this is a no teeth bottom, but let's say if you have this one, and you don't wanna spend more money on a no teeth. Just get one of these Teflon feet, some crazy glue, put it on. When it's, you know, done, you just go ahead and uh, cut out the places that uh, shouldn't have uh, Teflon. Or the same thing, you could do the same thing for a plate. Go ahead and glue it on, and from this side, you could go ahead and get a razor blade and cut out all the holes and, you know. Could work with everything. It's a, it's a great idea and you could save a lot of money. 
But what's going to happen is going to be permanent. You can't take it out unless you take it out and, um, you know, somehow get rid of the crazy glue. But it's going to stay there. So this is the video that I made especially for people that um, were calling me regarding the uh, Juki Len 81 or GS-0303. Um, this is everything right there. The machine comes with everything and you could get extra plate and feed dogs uh, by going to our website www.goldstartool.com. Uh, thank you for all your support and thank you for uh, um, getting back to me and letting me know, you know, what videos you want me to do, what you're looking for. Uh, please follow our YouTube videos, Facebook videos, like, thumbs up, and follow us. And thank you for watching www.goldstartool.com.